We woke up and saw the beautiful Christopher Columbus statue pointing towards the west and knew that this was the day, the inaugural cruise of the Carnival Venezia. Let's take you along our journey. We've been in Barcelona for four days and absolutely enjoyed every second of it. But we did not forget, we are here to cruise. We were so excited to wake up this morning, May the 29th, and finally see for the first time the Carnival Venezia as we pulled up to the port of Barcelona, Terminal E. She may look familiar. She's a Vista-class ship, and we were so looking forward to getting on board her. When we pulled up, you can see the line of people. Everyone was as excited as we were to go through check-in, to go through security, and to get on board this beautiful ship. We had the 9 o'clock check-in time, which was the earliest that you could have, and so did all of these other people. Before we knew it, the porters were there. Luggage was moving, the line was moving, and instead of being outside uh, waiting to check in, we were now inside going through security, which was much like security in the United States. Uh, they scanned our bags, they made sure we didn't have anything that we should not have, and it was a breeze. We then went into the check-in station where, again, it was just probably 20 or 25 minutes of setting, making sure everyone was ready to go. The agents were there, making sure your account looks good. We were excited to see Christine Duffy again as she shared her remarks on this big day for the Carnival Venezia. Good morning, Christine. Are you all ready? We're ready. Oh my gosh. I can't wait for everybody to see the ship. She is a beauty, really. You know, it's like yeah, I've got 25 kids, uh -huh. and I guess the newest one's always your favorite. But this one is really, really special. So can't wait to share We're excited. fun Italian style with everyone. Some Woo! great new restaurants, and she is a brand new chef. What an That's honor. right. It's it's exciting. So honored to be here. Yeah. Oh, good, Thank you. Good. Thank you for leading this project. Christine, we were with you uh, when Mardi Gras came into North America for the oh, first time. Man. And we couldn't step on board. And now look how far we've come. Now in Barcelona, Spain, cruising has opened up to the rest of the world. And here we are selling again. Yes. Everybody. Yes. Different cultures, all kinds of people, ages, walks of life. That's right. It's as so it cool. Be, as exactly. It be. Exactly. So I think we're so much all fun. even more appreciative and grateful for the freedom yeah. to be able to Absolutely. travel and cruise yeah. again, right? Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah. Now it's been quite a journey. It's it has. Quite a journey. And Captain, you ready? Yes, and you? I'm good. I'm you ready. ready fun? I'm ready. I'm ready. Everything's ready to go. Everything is ready. It's good. Ready for you guys. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. And we're gonna do the best. Ah. Always. Yeah. You always do. It's a little bit different. It's not what yeah. you used to do. But I enjoy it. <laughs> much better. You probably feel more at home though, right? Excuse me? You feel more at home, right? Yes. It's yeah. more of a, an Italian way yeah. to do it. Yeah. It's a nice thing. We're changing a little bit. we The pictures are beautiful. <laughs> and uh, you know, you will be impressed. That's I think with my car. Now, what's your favorite, what's your favorite Chief engineer. Part? My favorite yes, part of the ship is uh, there is a couple of restaurants in Viaggio that is very, very nice. And then uh, it's uh, very, very nice, the steakhouse, which is a classic, very nice uh, place. And for sure, all the deck five, it's beautiful. It's really stunning. And that's only going to be open at night, right? It's a good job. Yeah, the one that is more open at night. But it's an experience that must be tried. It's very beautiful. Oh, what's Just that like that? The ship? <laughs> okay, boss. Good morning, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to ask you a very, very special question, and the answer can only be heard by your applause. So put your cameras down, right? Because the only way for me to hear right around this wonderful terminal is by applause. Are you excited and proud to be the first ever people <laughs> to <laughs> <laughs> That answers that. Now, um, first of all, thank you to all of you who just took photos. Of, uh, 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 an incredible uh, thank you for me on a personal note for all your wonderful wishes uh, for me and the family. I do appreciate them more than words can say. We are here to celebrate something very special. 
and we want to get straight into it because we want to get you on board as quickly as possible. <laughs> but this is a tradition, it's become a very special one, and it gives me yet again an opportunity to invite somebody to speak to you. I know you all love her, you write to me, you tell me every day how much you do, and thank her for all the things that she does each and every day to make your cruise experience as good and as brilliant as it is. And uh, it gives me a chance to welcome not just the president of Carnival Cruise Live, but somebody who I consider, and I hope it's okay for me to say this, a wonderful friend, because she has been such a great support to me as she is, for every crew member, every shoreside person. She truly is the epitome of what a company president should be. So without further ado, please would you say thank you and welcome your president, Ms. Christine Duffy, for Steve. sacrifice for all of us and for our freedom and Bonnie who I just met um, thank you for letting me know the appropriate way to acknowledge this important day so wanted to start with that and I was speaking with some guests over here who you know we, we've been through uh, and are completely on the other side of the rearview mirror that was the pandemic, where we really didn't have the freedom or ability to travel, and certainly not on a cruise ship. So I think we're all even more appreciative and more excited and to be here in beautiful, beautiful Barcelona to uh, all of the members here from the port. Um, it's always a pleasure to see you, to be here, uh, and of course, so many of our loyal carnival guests. Uh, we have lots of platinum and diamond members on this cruise, and I know we will get lots of feedback from you <laughs> before the ship gets to New York. I will be uh, on board until we get to Lisbon. I really do look forward to hearing from you and meeting many of you. Uh, of course, I also want to thank our colleagues at Costa Cruises, which is our sister brand. You probably noticed this ship does not have a whale tail. So uh, she still holds on to her uh, Costa uh, yellow stack, but I think you will see for yourselves that she is an incredibly beautiful and elegant ship, and we are very proud to uh, have with us Costa's Vice President of Guest Experience, Giuseppe Carino. Beppe is here. Beppe, stand up. <laughs> we promised Beppe that we would take very good care of his baby. And so, uh, no worries, right? Um, it's certainly been a lot of activity uh, since the ship officially joined the fleet back in March. And uh, she did a dry dock because, of course, we had to make her carnival fun Italian style. So uh, you're going to get to experience that firsthand as the first ever guest. Uh, and of course, I want to thank and acknowledge our senior officers that are here, starting with Captain Claudio, our Chief Desiree, our Hotel Director Carl, and our Human Resource Director Monica. And of course, which you will see in just a few minutes, the very, very special secret of why Carnival Cruise Line has been so successful and that is our team members on board who are about to welcome you, our shoreside team members uh, that worked on this ship, uh, who have really worked tirelessly to bring Carnival Fun Italian Style to life. And uh, she's just an incredible addition to the Carnival fleet. And you know we've got another sister of this ship coming in 2024, Carnival Firenze, who will be homeporting in Long Beach. So, lots of new spaces, new experiences, uh, and again, you'll uh, 
you'll let us know what you think, I'm sure. Um, I also want to let you know that I brought a special friend along with me. We have our Chief Culinary Officer, Emeril Lagasse, who will be sailing with us through Lisbon. And um, I can tell you right now, Emeril is in the galley uh, tasting uh, and, uh, and making the adjustments that he thinks appropriate to some of our um, exciting new menu items. Uh, so I hope we'll we see all of you. We will have an exclusive cooking demonstration with Emerald tomorrow that is a fundraiser for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. So before we get uh, ready to cut this ribbon and get everybody on board, we have one more piece of business. As many of you know, traditionally when a ship visits a port for the first time, there is an exchange of plaques between the ship and the port. And we're going to do that today. And I'd like to introduce Captain Claudio to come up and handle the exchange. Good morning to you all. It's truly an honor to be here in front of all of you and have the possibility to introduce this beautiful vessel in this magnificent town. And uh, I would like to have uh, the persons that we'd like to exchange it with. Thank you. So it's a uh, really an honor to receive from you the token of appreciation and uh, for our first colleague in Barcelona. So good morning everyone. On behalf of the Port Authority of Barcelona, I would uh, tell you that I'm uh, very, very impressed because uh, this beautiful tradition, I have never been with uh, so many uh, passengers and distinguished guests, so I'm very, very happy. And on behalf of the Port Authority, we would like to welcome this magnificent ship, the captain, the crew, of course, all of you. We hope that you feel in Barcelona as if you were at home, because this is our dream. And I would like to wish you a safety navigation and a lot of fun. Like what? <coughs> Likewise, we like to reciprocate your courtesy by giving you a small candle of Venezia as the memory of our Let's go here. This is a little gift that represents our yes, organization, Guardia Civil. This is a seal. Yes, of course. Welcome to the city and thank you very much for being here.
So good morning, everybody. Um, in behalf of uh, our port agency, this agency, uh, we welcome you in Barcelona. It's a pleasure for us to be your agency here, and we wish you the best in this new adventure. Thank you so much. I forgot to bring four. <laughs> Stealing yours, I'm going to give it back. It's my fault, right? I thought tres in Spanish was cuatro. It doesn't matter. I got it wrong. I have to apologize. It's my fault. tradition. Um, and now it is really time to get you on our beautiful ship. So, <laughs> you see we've got the ribbon and we've selected a very special young man and his family. Zach Thomas is taking his 48th cruise for Carnival. He's a diamond cruiser along with his parents Stacy and Jay. They're from Kentucky. Uh, they are cruising today, and um, I heard it was Zach really wanted to meet me. So, you know, Zach, we're going to be hanging out together on Venezia. Zach's dad is also a member of the U.S. Army and uh, also a um, uh, state Kentucky, retired Kentucky State Trooper. Uh, so we look forward to having a drink together at the Heroes Tribute Bar that you'll see on board. It's a beauty here. Uh, so I'm going to ask Captain Claudio and the Thomas family to help me cut the ribbon, Zach. Now remember, these are big scissors. They really do cut. Oh, wait, before that, we have a nice medal for you. Look at this. That spins around. Zach. All right, are you ready? OK. Do we need to stand on that? This side is good. All right, Zach. So everybody's going to help us with the countdown. With the countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Christine. Thank you, Captain. Thank you, Chief. Thank you to all of our uh, people here who have helped in this very special ceremony. Um, I'm going to ask you please just to take a seat. We'll be begin boarding by zone numbers in just a few minutes and we'll all be waiting for you on the ship. Have a fabulous, fabulous time. Thank you so much. Please take a seat. Boarding will begin. Here we are, finally. A long morning in Barcelona, all kinds of activities. The terminal was a little bit late to open up. Then of course we had the check-in process, security process. We had an event that I will post here in just a little bit. John Hill, Christine Duffy and others, uh, the traditional exchange of gifts. And now it's time to board the Venezia and look at her. Wow, beautiful weather today. The sun is out, but it's only probably 72, literally 72 degrees. The Costa stack. Some people do not like that uh, Carnival did not put the well tail on. But as I pointed out, it's to pay tribute to her life and time as a Costa ship. We've got the gangway, and then we're going to get on board this beautiful ship. Let's see what's in store for celebration once we get on. 
See you guys on board. Hello. Thank you, thank you. Venezia. Here we go. with you on the dream last June. Yeah, it's good to see you, Absolutely. man. Absolutely. Hey, oh. congrats on the gig. Thanks, man. Oh. It's going to be a fun cruise. So you all settled in? Yeah, we've had about five Most weeks, part. so yeah, you know. Good, good. good. good We're deal. excited, man. It's going to be fun. You go check on the Emerald thing, Amanda. What? Where's Christine? Go check. Hey, Amanda, the Emerald Shore Excursions desk. How about that celebration? Carnival really outdid themselves in making sure that everyone felt welcomed, celebrating everyone as they walked on board the ship. Christine Duffy and Emerald and several other Carnival executives are selling with us for part of the journey. We are bringing everything to you. Make sure you're subscribed and you have the bell rang. That way, when we upload content and go live, you will receive that notification. We can't wait to bring you everything on board the Carnival Venezia. Matter of fact, right now, let's go to Lido Deck. Amanda and I were anxious as we walked toward Lido Deck. We had seen pictures and renderings of what this space was supposed to look like, and we absolutely knew it was going to be different than the, than the traditional Carnival Lido style. As we approached going outside, we were hungry. We knew that Guy's Burger would be out there, but we were absolutely floored when we saw this new concept of Carnival Fun Italian style. The retractable roof was open. The sun was shining. The lounge chairs were out. The pool was soon to be open. Yes, the, the deck space is smaller than other traditional Carnival ships of this size, but the venues that surround the four corners of Lido Deck are absolutely beautiful, including Java Blue Cafe. There's a new bar on board and a new place to eat that we will show you in our ship tour. And of course, Guy's Burger. We knew very quick we had to take a look around and we had to get back to Guy's Burger Joint and try this new concept, this new idea of a pepperoni-inspired, Italian-inspired burger. Here we go, new pepperoni burger. A guy's burger joint, Carnival Venezia. Fried cheese. Ah, pepperoni marinara sauce, looks good. Mm -mm -mm. 
And three pepperoni on this is the crispy pepperoni. Huh? Wow. Can you put it in the Wow. Mm. You see that amazing? This mozzarella. Wow. Mm. Wow. And the salmon and cheese. There you go. Wow, that's beautiful. Wow. Yes, please. Let's look at this real quick. Unbelievable. Carnival Venezia, guys burger joint, new pepperoni burger. Take a look at this thing. Fried mozzarella, shredded parmesan, cut up pepperoni strips, and of course, melted cheese patty unbelievable right here carnival venezia had to share it with you i'm about to eat so there it is it was good and we are on board we've only been on board three hours and i've got this video out to you guys we can't wait to share experiences the rest of the cruise 15 days everything coming straight to you be sure you're subscribed let us know if we can help you in any way email us at travel at bookislandtime.com we'll see you guys later